See, here's the deal. About half a century ago, some physicists noticed that the mathematical equations that describe wave functions and quantum physics and so forth don't necessarily have to reflect our universe alone. In fact, those equations are consistent with the picture that every time a quantum particle does something or doesn't do something, a whole new universe is spawned. Oh. Okay? Imagine if, for example, I go out there and I get hit by the jitney. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. That, that I have a good lawyer for that. Thank you. Okay. As we determine. In, in most cases, I would not be in good shape. But you could imagine a scenario in the universe where I'm hit by the jitney and I'm fine. Just that one tiny possibility. If that happens, then that universe has me in it just fine. And then all the other universes, they continue to coexist, but I'm not fine. Now imagine tomorrow I get hit again. By and then that process happens all over again. There's a tiny little possibility that I'm fine. And that person survives. If I keep following the surviving me in front of the jitney, I am in a universe where I live forever. Ooh. Eh? Isn't yeah, cool? but you all you keep getting hit by the bus. damn bus. Yeah. <laughs> that, right. That's that not, sounds like hell. That ain't so good. I agree. <laughs> but you see, the vast majority of other universes that exist right. in this in this mathematical many worlds, I'm not fine. And that's the one that we are most likely going to share. Right, because the chances of me being fine after being hit by the jitney a few are, thousand are times very, 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 very small. Right, but you can see the problem with this many worlds hypothesis of quantum physics. Right, you're generating essentially a nearly infinite number of new universes every single second that the universe is around. It's not quite infinite because the universe isn't infinitely old, but in every single circumstance, you can imagine literally anything happening. 